You know how bad I am at wrapping gifts. But I didn't want to just um, stick this in a bag, so I tried. You brought me a gift? No. Actually, it's for Tammy. Oh. <laughs> oh. I know how much you love my horses, so I, uh, I made her one. Oh. Wow, she's gonna love this. She's... I hope so. You know, that kid got to me the other day. She's, uh, she's very loving. She's a good kid. Yeah. And, you know, she smiles, and it's like sunshine with teeth. <laughs> she got to me. Sunshine with teeth. Yeah. I'll have to remember that one. <laughs> could you tell her that I'm going to miss her? And could you tell her that uh, <clears throat> I'm going to miss her almost as much as I'm going to miss her mother? That's the truth. That's why I came here, to tell you that I miss you. I should have been a lot more understanding when you asked me to be, and I'm sorry about that. It's not your fault. Please don't apologize. I'm very thick-headed, you know? It's, it's been a problem of mine my whole life, especially when I don't get things that I want or they don't go the way I want them to, you know? And I don't know. I was just wondering if, if there was any hope or chance that we could have another shot at this. Dinah, you think you're pregnant? Well, who's the father? <laughs> I wasn't abducted by an alien's mother. If I'm pregnant, Hart's the father. Well, how did this happen? You mean to tell me you've had three children and you still don't know yet? That's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about Hart and Cassie. Are, 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 they still, are they still broken up? Yes, they're broken up. I told you they were broken up. And Hart is back where he belongs, with me. The true... Love of his life, the woman who truly loves him. Well, I'm not trying to be critical. It's just that you never wanted children. You didn't want to have children. What is it, sweetie? Come here. Come here. There you are. I was wondering what you guys were doing. Hi. Is everything all right? Yeah. Uh, yeah, everything's fine. Uh, sweetie, she's a little fussy. Would you mind taking her inside? Sure. Thanks. We'll Bye. be inside if you need us. Bye. 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 Look, I'm not trying to be critical. It's just that you and Hart have had such a rocky road that I can't help but wonder Could here. you do something for me, Mother, please? Just don't judge me. Could you do that? I'm not judging you, but I am concerned. Don't be. Just be happy for me. I don't want you to take this the wrong way. I love our family and friends, and this is so sweet, but I'm... I just want to be alone with you. Right. I just want to be alone in bed with you now. Exactly. Okay. How do we do that? We eat very fast and smile a lot, okay? Okay. okay. Check. I like that. Finished? Oh, is Blake having a good time at St. Louis? Oh, yes, I think uh, Ed having a job to focus on is the best thing for her. Plus, she just flat out needed to get away. Yep. And how is Holly holding up? Frankly, I don't see that much of her because I'm so busy at the office, but I think, you know, having the boys around, it's eased the pain of losing Meg. Honey, you know that I'll love and support you no matter what. But, but I don't want to see you in a situation where you get hurt or, God forbid, a child does. That's not going to happen, Mother. Okay. If, if this is what you want, and if you think that you're really ready to have a baby, then I'll support you all the way. I just, I just want to make sure that you're doing this for the right reasons. So what are you saying? You think this is some kind of a plan to snag heart? It's not, Mother, so don't think that, okay? I, I already got him back. I certainly don't need to have a baby to hang on to him. But if I'm pregnant, and I hope that I am, it'll be the icing on our wedding cake. Well, I hope so, Diana. I really do. Thank you. But don't tell anybody, okay? Because I don't want anybody to know until I'm really sure. 
I won't tell anybody. Okay. You know, nothing could make me happier in the whole wide world than to see you really happy. Thank you. Mother, I, having Hart's baby is going to be a turning point for me. I know it is. Good. I'll see you inside. Okay. And who cares if Rob is the father? What Hart doesn't know won't hurt him. You know, I, I've been through this uh, at least a million times in my head. And, uh... Now that I'm face to face with you, I'm, I'm very nervous here. I don't know uh, where to start. Well, let's start with us. How about us? How about us? <sighs> okay. Um, I'm gonna go way out on a limb here. And I'm gonna tell you that I don't believe what you said to me when we broke up. No. no. You told me that you didn't give a damn about me and that it was all an act. Yeah, I said that. You didn't really mean that. No, I didn't. No. I knew it. I knew it. Why did you say that? I don't know why I said it, because... I guess I thought the time maybe we needed a break and you were yelling at me and I was confused and I was mad. I don't know why I said that to you. Okay. I'm not going to push this. I just want us to be back to where we were before all this nonsense started. So do I. So do I. Are you willing to give us another shot? I'd really like to try. I would love that. No one has to know we slept together last night. And if we do it again, they don't have to know that either. Plus, of course, you're leaving earrings around my place. I know that you're trying to make me feel better, Ben, but I'm afraid I'm a lost cause. My life is too much of a mess right now. Yeah, no, not for long. I can't thank you enough for everything that you've done for me. No, oh, you don't have to thank me. I like you, Beth. But you can show me a quiet place where I can make a phone call. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Where's Harley? She left. <clears throat> well, Lizzie's still upset. So I'm going to take off the rest of the day and spend it with her. You know, Beth, I don't know what you're up to or why, but somehow or another, Ben Warren has ended up in your corner, and that really scares the hell out of me. Well, you know what, Philip? I don't care what you think. Okay. Well, you know, that's actually fine, because I don't care either. Since when? You know more than you're telling me, but I have done every damn thing I can. You want to take the fall for this? You go and take the fall, because I'm done. My daughter wants me to read her story. 